In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to create a duotone effect in less than 30 seconds. So I'm in Photoshop right now and what I did is I dragged and dropped an image in and I put a cool gradient map on top that has two colors so the shadows and the highlights create this duotone effect. And I'm going to show you how to do this. So I'm going to go to my picture. It can be any image you want and I'm going to drag it and drop it into Photoshop. I'm going to crop this image, so I'll press C and I'll hold Alt and left click and you can drag these in to crop that just to be quick. And then what I'm going to do is go to the right hand side where your layers panel in is, go down to the drop down menu. You see this little circle with like two ellipses inside of it. I'm going to click that and then I'm going to click on gradient map. So you can see it's the second last menu there. And then you can see in my layers panel now what I have is this layer that says gradient map and what you want to do is I can double click on this um, icon here with the gradient and you'll get this properties met box pop up here I can left click once and it should open a box what happens is it comes with all these different presets if you have the latest um, Photoshop file right so I can select a blue one if I want which is really really cool but if not maybe I want my own brand colors right so Obviously, I can use some of these different ones, but I want to add my own brand color. So I'll double click on the slider here. And then I can change my color. I'll go to like an orangey color, right? So the left hand side is going to be your shadows. The right hand side is going to be your highlights. So the light areas. So I'm going to double click on that. And then I'm going to change it to maybe a yellowish color. Press OK. So right now you can see this is what it looks like. If I want to change it, I can double click on the slider again. And maybe make it a darker tone so the shadows you always want a little bit darker but you don't want to go too dark you want to sort of go in the middle there and still have that darkish color maybe I'll drop it to a bit red press ok and press ok and then you're done and now we have a duo tone effect just like that and the cool thing about this is you don't even need a black and white photo you can just leave the photo like that I can also make another layer with a brightness and contrast I can bump the contrast up as you can see if I zoom in it can increase that I can increase the brightness a little bit, but not too much. So you can see that. And I can literally turn off these layers like that. And so simply, you can have a dual tone image. You can use it for web or, you know, projects that or for social media or stuff like that. So that's how you create a dual tone effect. Hope you guys enjoyed this Photoshop tutorial. Let me know if you want to see more Photoshop tutorials like this. And I hope to see you in the next video. Remember to subscribe and hit that like button. And I'll see you next time. Take it easy.